A Call Curtis investigation. Massage Envy is accused of taking away massages people earned. After a Sacramento viewer claimed that the company stripped him of 35 massages, Curtis learned that the issue is now the subject of a class action lawsuit. Exactly right. Now, when you become a member at Massage Envy, you earn massages. But when you stop paying into the program, you may lose all of those massages you earned and did not use. To really work out his stress, Robert Oates gets a massage. It's more like a treat for me. Seven years ago, he joined Massage Envy's membership program. For 59 bucks a month, he'd receive a credit for one massage. And if he didn't use it, the program rolled it over until the next month. But after he lost his job in 2010, Robert stopped paying into the program. Still, he was able to use his credits. And I probably used about 10 of them. And he still has a lot left. Presently, I have 35 credits. But he says Massage Envy told him he can't access his 35 massages unless he pays to become a member again. So basically buy another massage to use a massage. He's definitely not alone. Attorney William Restis is representing as many as 130,000 Californians in a class action lawsuit filed against Massage Envy, claiming unfair business practices. He says massages should not be forfeited when accounts are closed. Fundamentally unfair for a lot of reasons, but primarily because people are paying for prepaid massages that Massage Envy reserves the right to never perform. Plaintiffs in the case are asking Massage Envy to either reinstate the massages or compensate those who lost prepaid massages. A spokesperson for Massage Envy tells us the language in the membership agreement is entirely consistent with California law. And the court has expressed no opinion as to whether the plaintiff's allegations are correct. As for Robert, Massage Envy said he signed a contract acknowledging he may have to forfeit massages. So we took a closer look at his contract. And check it out. Robert never signed it. Massage Envy then admitted a mistake was made and agreed to compensate him for those 35 massages, a total of $2,065. And now Robert can take his money and spend it any way he wants. I can go anywhere to get a massage. And we just learned today of a possible settlement in the class action case. The attorneys for the class are not giving specifics, but say they are very happy with it, although it may not be finalized until early next year. Massage Envy would not comment. So how do customers know if they're included in this class action lawsuit? Everybody who was affected should have received a postcard in the mail, giving them the option to opt out of the class action case. Uh, if they did not opt out, they are automatically included. Okay, okay. very yep. good. All right, if you have something you want us to investigate, let us know about it. You call our hotline Monday through Friday or go to our website, cbs13.com slash call Curtis and fill out our form.